Um, also, I, what I wanted to revisit was um, over the past year, we've seen you guys collaborate a lot with musicians and appear in a lot more places than just, yeah. you know, Instagram. Um, music and fashion have always, you know, had had a conversation everywhere. So talk about that experience. You've got, uh, I think, Daniel Zafar, Manu, Dalal Qureshi, Hasan Rahim, all these people. Even on Coke Studio, there was Rasta. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. So, how did you make that step? How has that been? Has that had any noticeable uh, impact? Or is it just, you know, worth doing? That's that's a very good question. It definitely has had like a symbiotic positive uh, relationship for mm. both sides of the table. And this was a very conscious decision for us that we want to align ourselves as a brand with young up and coming artists, not the old school uh, artists within our industry. In fact, we're trying to create an environment now that we sort of cater mostly and solely to these young and upcoming uh, artists because they are the new sound that sort of represents this generation that also consumes uh, Rasta and I think it's very important for a brand like Rasta that has been able to carve out an international footprint to be able to sort of style the artists from within its uh, its own country. I think that is more yeah. important than styling artists from abroad because the Talal Qureshis and the Hassan Rahims and the Manus of today, these people are going to be the Atif Aslams of tomorrow. They're going to be, you know, sort of the biggest stars. Some of them are are, are already at that sort of yeah. level. And I think it's just sort of the vibe. For me, it's the vibe. Like, I need to like the music and it, it needs to sort of just really resonate with me. That's why I, you know, just like to style these people. And what we want to do now is that we want to start making custom pieces for a lot of these artists as well. Okay, okay. Huh. Yeah. Well, by custom pieces, you mean uh, something specifically for Amanu or Hassan Rahim or something made in collaboration with them to be part of a collection? So it could be anything, right? It could be a capsule in collaboration with a musician. We've seen that a lot abroad, yeah. you know. We've we've seen Travis Scott with with his shoes. We've seen Drake with his collabs with uh, with Nike. I think that is something that definitely needs to happen in Pakistan as well. Yeah. That and also creating one-off pieces for the artists so that they know that, you know, there's a brand over here that is willing to cater to our style and create pieces that sort of match our aesthetic and match their aesthetic as well. It's something that's very common abroad, yeah, uh, yeah. especially in European houses where Louis Vuitton or Gucci are going to make custom pieces for you know, the artists that they have good relationships with. Yeah, even in the watch world, like uh, Jay-Z, Pharrell, etc., they all have custom-made watches for them. Yeah, exactly.